two Bible verses. And one is um, Matthew 25, 40, and it says, The king will reply, I tell you the truth, whatever you did for one of the least of these brothers of mine, you did for me. Who is that talking, um, referring to Jesus, right? When, if we do something for somebody else, we're doing it for Jesus, right? And then the other one is Psalm 91.11. For he will command his angels concerning you to guard you in all your ways. And that means what? That we have angels, that our angels are going to watch over us, right? Okay. So I want you to think about that when, as I tell you my little story. <coughs> Pastor Luis had traveled to a city a couple hours away from his home. It was going to be a short trip, but the first thing he wanted to do when he got to the city was go to his favorite donut store. And so it was dark, and uh, when he got there, and he parked underneath the streetlight in, in an alley, it was a dark alley, and he parked underneath the streetlight, and he got out. And he started walking up down the alley, and he wasn't afraid. A lot of people are afraid to walk in the dark alleys, but Pastor Luis wasn't afraid. Do you know why he wasn't afraid? He had Jesus, and he was following the Holy Spirit, okay? In his heart, he was doing what God was telling him to do. So as he's walking down the dark alley, he comes across a, a homeless man who's leaning up against the wall of the building. And um, <clears throat> the homeless man had a jacket on that didn't fit him right, was too small. He had a hat pulled down around his ears because it was cold, and his shoes were all worn down thin. And, uh, but that wasn't the worst thing. The worst thing was he had a tumor that was growing out of his stomach and it looked gross. And, but when Pastor Luis saw that man, he went right to that man and he said, are you doing okay? And the man said, I'm fine. And the pastor says, no, you're not. You look sick. Um, <clears throat> Can I help you somehow? And the man said, No, no, not really. Um, I'm okay. I'll be okay. And um, so the man, Pastor Luis, said, um, But you're not healthy, are you? And the man said, Well, he said, I just got out of the hospital yesterday, but I'll be okay. Thank you for asking. And uh, Pastor Luis said, Are you hungry? Can I get you something to eat? And the man said, no, 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 I'm fine, thanks. I'll be okay. I don't want to waste your time. And Pastor Luis says, I, I, you're not wasting my time. Maybe I'm wasting your time. And uh, the man said, well, he says, I'll be okay. It was nice of you to talk to me. Well, then Pastor Luis saw at the end of the alley, he remembered that there's food carts there. And I don't know if you've ever seen a food cart. We don't really have them here, but maybe at a fair or something, you see these little carts and people cook things. And, and he saw the food carts and he said, hey, come with me to the food cart. The Mexican one has great burritos and you can have a burrito. And the guy says, mm, okay. So he went with him to the food cart, the Mexican food cart. And Pastor Luis said, get whatever you want. He says, I'm going to pay for it, okay? And so the man says, I'll have one super duper burrito. And so Pastor Luis, he said, oh. so he ordered him three burritos, a tostada, and something to drink. And so while they were waiting for the food order to be finished, all of a sudden, they heard a huge, loud, raucous noise. It was horrible. And he looked ahead. Over there was his donut shop. 
And there were all these motorcycles there, and they had, were waving guns, and they were loud, and people were screaming, and people were running everywhere, and uh, it was just so scary. And, um, and Pastor Luis and, and his friend just stood and watched, and they were just shocked. And um, so then, all of a sudden, the um, person at the food cart said, your order's ready. And by that time, then the noise at the donut shop had kind of simmered down and the motorcycles had roared away. And he turned around, and as he was turning around, he was thinking, I could have been in that donut shop. I could have been killed. Because by now, sirens were coming, and ambulances, and police, and fire trucks were all coming to the donut shop. And Pastor Luis realized that if he hadn't stopped to talk to the homeless man, he would have been in that donut shop. So he was filled with gratitude to God for that. And then, um, so he gave his friend, his new friend, the burritos and the tostada and the drink. And he says, here, you enjoy this for later. And the man, you know what the man said to him? He said, thank you for the burritos, Pastor Luis. And he turned and he walked down the alley. And Pastor Luis was like, I didn't tell him my name. I don't know his name. We didn't exchange names. How did he know I'm Pastor Luis? Well, it didn't matter the sounds of the sirens. It didn't matter all any of that stuff anymore. All he could hear in his head, Pastor Luis, he could hear, thanks for the burritos, Pastor Luis. And I just love this story because so many times we're afraid to do things. Um, but there's people who need us, not and here in our church too, but outside our church, on the street corners, like Pastor Luis found. And so um, I just want you to think about that when you say your prayers every day, <coughs> ask Jesus to lead you and guide you, and he will. He'll take you right where he wants you to be, okay? So let's say a little quick prayer, all right? Do you want to pray? Would you like to pray? Okay. Lord Jesus, thank you for this wonderful day. Makes everyone safe. Lord Jesus, amen. Amen. So now I, my song um, is. Uh, goes kind of along with the story. And, um, and I'm just playing, I'm, I don't really have music, I just have chords, and I'm not very good with chords. So just try to listen to the words and ignore my, my plunkings. <laughs> <clears throat>
And for this I fear we stand accused So many times I so freely bend to sin In spite of myself I would come through Make no mistake, I know from whence it comes Something down inside tells me what to do Yes.